for illegal importation of your kin through barrels, and most importantly, attempted theft of a fruit hat banana. Captain Pickles, how do you plea? <laughs> Guilty? But Captain Pickles, I grow tired of your monkey business. Uko, send him away. <laughs> Hold on, Uko. What's this you say about monkey treasure? Captain Pickles? <laughs> All right, Captain Pickles. You have yourself a deal. But I warn you, don't make me regret this. Swab the poop deck. Hoist the mainsails. Uh, uh, cut the jib. Forward, Captain Pickles. We've got monkey treasure to find. Yeah, I'm the Fruit Knight, architecture renovations technician, and you best believe that I'm the best that there's ever been. I'm great, but yeah, yeah. Mr. Grandwater, oh, Mr. Grandwater. Ah, uh, uh, Cyril, um, Occupado, uh, please come back in like a, a tw twenty minutes or so. Oh, Mr. Great White, sir, the, uh, the townspeople, they, they demand your, your audience. Uh, my, my, aud my audience? Um, you don't you think this is maybe something more suited for the, uh, uh, Fruit Night, Cyril? Oh, uh, the Fruit Night's actually, uh, um, he's, he's hunting monkey treasure? Hunting monkey, uh, 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 uh you know, Cyril, um... Yeah, I, I got this. Just give me like, um, like, yeah, give me like 10 minutes. I'll be right out. <laughs> well, let's see how you handle life without your precious fruit night, Mr. Fart. I must admit, having to sit here and watch Great White for 246 days has not been without some benefits. Although he is a bumbling fool who can hardly tell his head from a frost maggot in the ground, he does have some skill. Just when I start to believe that maybe I'm here to, to learn from this, this great white, this fart, all those thoughts are destroyed when I see how he, how he handles a town center. Who is this great white? Why am I mocked by his presence? I am determined to find answers, to get out of this hellhole. On the subject of this hellhole, just like Great White, it's not without its perks. The more time I spend here, the more I learn about this power that I've been given. Take for example, a simple block of dirt. I can spawn from thin air, and just as easily as I've given it life, I can take it away. But it doesn't stop with dirt. Bowls of soup from nothing. These pants from nowhere. How is this possible? What's this? I need everybody to take a deep breath and calm down. We can handle this like adults. Uh, Stanton the Geologist, I appreciate your enthusiasm, but the torch is not necessary. We're not going to be burning anything down today. Lena? The Fruit Knight is busy, um, he's, uh, he's hunting monkey treasure, sir. Right, thanks, Cyril. He's hunting monkey treasure. Um, I can help you with whatever you need, though. What seems to be the problem, Linda? Right, so someone stole your soup. Okay, we're gonna put it down in the log here, looking for a soup thief. As if somebody would ever want to steal your soup. What? No, uh, nothing. No, I just wrote it down right here. Uh, look for missing soup. I wonder. Is there anyone else that has an issue they want to bring to my attention? I've lost my dentures. Oh, Janine, you don't have any dentures. What? I don't have any dentures. You don't have any dentures. Does anyone have any real problems they want to bring to my attention? 
All right, missing pants. That... Wait, you're not making fun of me, are you? Okay, that is a legitimate problem. Missing pants around here have become a real issue. Missing pants? It can't be. It wasn't long ago that I... The soup. But where did the pants... What do we have here? Merchants? Adventurers? Warriors? Villagers? Arietta Cyril. Mr. Teeter. Oh, man. Oh, man. Keep it together, Mr. Teeter. Keep it together, Mr. Teeter. It's all in your head. Oh, man. Hmm. I wonder. Crazy stuff going on. Oh, but it's not real. It's not real. It's on your head. It's on your head. It's going to be fine. Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! An unfortunate side effect, to be sure. I just don't think we should leave out the possibility that you're all just crazy. Okay, Mr. Teeter? Mr. Teeter! Mr. Teeter! Uko? Can you please escort Mr. Teeter away from the premises? Let's give this another try. Hmm. Who looks promising? Janine. You can't just go around paddling other people's kids! I'm just saying, maybe if I had a good whooping, it wouldn't be yelling so much. Oh boy, what a heat wave! Janine, tell me everything that you know about Great White. Oh, Great White! You look so different, you got a hair. No, I'm not Grey White. I want you to tell me about Grey- Don't you have more important things going on than worrying about your hair? This reminds me of my grandson. He's about your age. Back when he was a little boy, he used to love collecting slimes and squires and all, and he'd pen them up and then uh, he'd give them each a name. 246 days, and only now am I starting to feel hopeless. But he'd name them after his favorite bottle nights, and then he'd bottle them! Janine, you're not talking to anybody! What? I said you're not talking to anybody! I'm not talking to anybody! Okay, somebody please tell me I'm not the only one that saw her disappear and then reappear again. You're not the only one that saw her disappear and then reappear again, sir! Cyril, are you actually telling me that, or are you just saying it because I told you to say that to me? Oh, I'm not really sure. Surely one of you hasn't been contaminated by his stupidity. Rig off. Tell me about Great White. Whoa, man, watch your language. This is supposed to be family friendly. I am glad that we see eye to eye, though. I need your help with something. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously though, do you want to help me be a bad guy?